NBC7's What's Up is sponsored by Cox, bringing us closer. I'm Marianne Cushy, and this is your morning update for Tuesday, May 31st. Concerns are being raised about reckless driving in San Diego County. Look at that. After one person was hit and injured Sunday night in Mission Valley by street racers, San Diego police saying more than 50 cars blocked an intersection performing donuts at high speeds when the person was injured. Right now, Democrats and Republicans are working on a bipartisan plan to address gun violence. The proposals being discussed include strengthening the background check system and school security, adding red flag laws which allow police or family members to seek court orders to take guns away from people who might pose a threat, and raising the gun buying age to 21. Today, state and local leaders will be coming together to push for affordable housing and homelessness solutions for veterans. In the Midway District, construction on a new temporary shelter is set to begin. All this comes after some homeless people say the cleanup encampment's effort was far from compassionate and believe it criminalizes homelessness. The hope is that this new shelter with the accompanying behavioral health services will be a step in the right direction. Well, gas prices rose about a half a cent overnight, bringing the average to 6.08 a gallon for regular unleaded. And for those of you keeping track of the increases, that is 5.3 per three cents. That is more than last week, more than 30 cents from last month, and $1.89 from this time last year. Here in California, we're paying almost $1.50 more than the national average of 4.62. The San Diego City Council could extinguish some bonfire traditions at our area beaches. The Council's Environment Committee voted unanimously last week to consider some new rules. One of the rules facing protest, beachgoers would only be allowed to build wood fires in the city-provided concrete fire pits. Coming up, Sheena with your first alert forecast. Cox Gigablast has all the speed to power your imagination. Workout. Big plans and movie night all at once. Switch to Gigablast, the internet that gets it done. Hi there, I'm NBC7 meteorologist Sheena Parveen. For today, the rest of the day, it's going to stay sunny, upper 60s at the coast. In La Valley, it's about the mid to upper 70s, mountains around 70 and sunny, deserts about the mid 90s. Overnight tonight looks pretty good, except we'll see those clouds moving back in through the overnight hours. Maybe a little patchy fog inland too. For the coast the rest of the week, though, we're going to see a little bit of a warming trend. So mostly the mid to low 70s at the coast, gradual clearing each day. Maybe just a little bit of a drop in temperatures over the weekend. For the inland valleys, low 80s, and then over the weekend, back around the mid 70s, Marion. Thanks, Sheena. And don't forget, you can get the very latest news right here at NBC7.com and on TV. And you can also learn more on our podcast. That's Today in San Diego, where we talk about the day's biggest headlines in less than five minutes. Stay safe, everybody, and have a great day.